continue the draft of game number three. Doggy and Tads, ano yung pwede natin expect dito Your na picks from both teams? Banning. Tingin ko, ban na yung Franco. Or sakaling hindi pipili yun ng Bren. Pero tingin ko dito magkakalabasa ng alas. Kasi oh. nakikita na natin may lapu-lapu na bilang lumabas. May Meron pang hanabi na lumabas. So tingin ko, it's not that uh, na nakaka-surprise ko mag-pick na naman ng isa pang conventional hero dito yung mga teams. Alright, how about you, Doggy? What do, what do you expect? What can we expect? I mean, it's so hard to predict right now kasi nasa 1-1 one -one situation sila. Yung isa man na, if any of this team win this game 3, mas lalakas yung confidence nila. They will have the momentum. Bren need to win this if they want to have the momentum. Archangel, the same. And like Illustrator said, Archangel, it's, there's so many tricky dun sa pick nila. Masyadong tricky sa mga pick. Masyadong silang nag-over... Over... Commit? Commit yeah. for that pick. So, ay yung, yung naging problema nila. I think, if they're gonna do that, it need to be a, a insurance to win. Kasi, this is crucial right now. Harit, siyempre mo open. Kimi already banned out. Harit, Brock, and uh, pr Your probably the uh, Lunox as well. Yeah. Anong pwede mapili dito ng Brainy Sports. But I think that they prioritize Harit pa rin. Yeah. 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 I, I, honestly, I like the fact that they banned Lunox. I mean, kasi alam naman natin na si Bren, mahilig din siya mag-approach uh, ng game from a two-mage perspective. You take that possibility away from them kasi napakalitado nga natin when it comes to those, uh, those uh, you know, assassin, those mages. But the beautiful thing is Your that Archangel is now have gotten that, uh, that Claude. Claude na feeling Archangel, like you said. As well as the Grok. Pero itong Claude, napakatapang ng Archangel to pick up the Claude early, at this early point. Well, we know naman yung Claude, napakahirap kontra. I want to ask the pros, ano yung mga pang-kontra or pang-sagot sa Claude? I mean, sa akin, na-predict ko to kaganina na sure, pag kinuha na yung Harry, tapos kinuha ng Archangels, yung Grok and Claude, instantly, they will go for that Chu and Leomord because they can, like, pwede nilang i-dominant tong pick draft na to kasi isipin ng Archangel, ano yan Chu niyan? It will be a fighter or a tank. Leomord is exceptionally super strong. Pwede niyang i-harass si Claude if Claude doesn't know how to position your well. So this is super risky. And then picking that, um, on Archangel, taking that Esmeralda, is good enough to sustain, but paano nila gagawin yan if Bren will initiate directly pag habang yeah. wala pang shield si Esmeralda? Mm -hmm. yeah. Totoo yun. Eh, well, adding to that, kasi yung Claude, well, ang, ang only escape mechanism nun niya is the BMI or, or the battle mirror image. Kung sakaling, sino mag-initiate? Si, si, si Cho mag-initiate, meron lagi nag-aabang na, na liumor sa, sa kabila. Or vice versa, ganun din. So, one of the best ways to control the Claude is at least take Your down, control him early down. game. Kung sakaling hindi mo siya makontrol early game, at least focus fire. Dapat lahat ng, ano, lahat ng uh, full damage ipapot mo sa kanya. But uh, again, making it more difficult for uh, for AA. Yung Esmeralda, tingin ko maganda rin. But uh, I think it's not that enough. Kulang pa siya when it comes to lockdown. So I think dito, picking. kung nakita natin, binan nila yung, yung Aka. I think Bren is going for that um, Franco pick. And tinanggalan nila Aka, like you said, na yun yung magiging counter sa kanya. So, 80% they might pick the Franco again since we, ha uh, we saw that Archangel have that Grok. But Archangel, they have the last pick. They can counter-initiate that pick. So it's all about Archangel now on that last pick. Alright, now, the Queen of the Guinevere na kinipili lagi dito ng Archangel. Picking. Actually, yung mga teams natin ngayon, para ang bilis nila pumili. Esmeralda as well as the Guinevere, very strong damage source para sa Archangel. A lot of control as well coming out from this Guinevere. Hindi ganun kaganda win rate ng Guinevere overall, pero sa Archangel it's actually really successful. Na natural para sa mga teams. Naturally will pick the carry laban sa isang Claude. And this time, since carry is available, Brenny Sports are considering it. Is this the right decision para sa Brenny Sports to, to answer the Claude with the carry? I mean, Rebo, he's super versatile. If you're gonna use that, um, if you're gonna use that carry, we know how he play carry. He's basically the one playing the carry on uh, on Brent's side. And then ako, going for that um, Leomord, it depends, it can switch up. But I'm pretty sure it will be Rebo. He can domi dominate that Claude because he know when to go in, when to dominate, when he reach certain level. Oh, I particularly like it on Bellerin no. laban sa Claude. It's kind of a classic counter. Dahil meron ka nga Flower of Life. And again, the damage from Claude is, you know, maliliit na para maraming beses ka mag siya ng damage. Which means na mas maraming beses mag-proc yung Flower of Life mo. It's one of those natural counters. But for Archangel, mukhang gusto nilang gamitin ang yeah. pinangla pinanglalaso ng Brady Sports, the Franco themselves. We actually talked about this a little bit earlier. This yung Archangel, kaya nilang gamitin yung Franco. They've shown yes. it to us before. And the fact that uh, already walang Akai, 
Mains that they can do it. Instead, of course, they go to pick the main sitar, which is really, really good. Gusto gusto ko yung main sitar pick. It's gonna help them get wow. to the back lines, get to that carry, and at the same time, um, nullify, uh, help them when it comes to a team fight situation. Meron na silang grok. So I really think this main sitar is honestly a really great pick. Wow. This main sitar actually answers the Leo Mort and the Joe. Dahil hindi po yung mag Junpo, hindi po yung mag uh, Jit Kundo, as well as yung ultimate ni. Uh, ni Leo Mord habang nasa ultimate niya ni uh, Min Sitar but of, of course mahirap nga namang gamitin yun now I wanna ask you very quickly sinong makakuha ng match point dito let's start with Illustrado uh, for me uh, Archangel because Archangel. I, I think the Min Sitar is honestly a really really great pick it answers like 3 out of the 5 heroes on the side you know of Brandy Sports okay uh, now, how about you Kuya Doggy? ano yung sayo? um so Sitar, another pick, another new pick coming from this meta. That's the new uh, meta from season two. Now they have it on season three. Nya alabas na nila. It's a, it's super very good pick. Cause first thing first, new carry, second skill dash, play more. Dash. Oh, uh, pag may kabayo oh, dash. Um, hurry. Two. two. Basically, na uh, four. Na, sorry, four na hero pick ng Brent is using dash skill. So with that pick, it's super good. And if ang um, Brent may Franco. <laughs> Archangel, they have that main sitar to pull yeah. someone off. Pure glory, of course. So, uh, Archangel, uh, but then, Archangel. Kaya, uh, Kuya Togi, how about you, Kuya Tads? Bren ako dito. Ay, <laughs> naku! <laughs> Hindi, bakit? Kasi mayroong Bellerick. Akala ko nung una, nung, nung inover nila yung Franco, which is a very good thing against Bellerick. Once on nature shield siya, may aalis niya kagad on top of, or when it comes to clashes, may hihiwalay niya yung Bellerick sa team fight. Pero nung nag-minsitar sila, yung hook kasi niya, kung merong hero sa likod ni Bellerick, yun yung mahuhook, hindi si Bellerick. That's true. So, yun yung pwedeng pang control. Pati sustainability, plus the factor of flower of life, sabi mo nga kanina, sa Claude, isa sa mga hard counters ng Claude. Uh, well, all about execution, pantay sila, but looking at the draft, I'll go for Brent. Okay, Brent, para kayo ito yun, ito na perfect pa rin sa kanyang mga predictions. Doggy naman, hindi pa rin nakakatama until now. But for now, hindi natin kumakatama naman ang ating mga shoutcaster. It's gonna be time for Manjin and Shinbu. Maraming salamat, Volt. At syempre, sa ating mga panel, tama ka dyan. Siguradong malakas ang tama ng ating larot. Lalo pat, game 3 na, 1-1. Yung ating race to 3, paunahan, makadalawang palalo. Mga kaibigan, Archangel versus Bren Esports. Instant reset atin ng iba to kagad. Sa laro, let's go, pump yung technique. <laughs> Red side ang Archangel at Bren ang All blue side. Best of three na po. Lagi, oh. ladies and gentlemen, for those guys na bagong, uh, bago sa esports, oh. iba po ang mentality kapag lalaro ka ng best of five. Oo. Oh. 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 Mm -hmm. Asim laro ng momentum yan eh. Tapos oh. grabe, ang daming mga techniques ang nare-reveal talaga dyan. Totoo. Clearly, yung draft later on nag a based on the draft that was witnessed on the earlier games. Correct. Mga kaibigan on the blue side ay ang Bren Esports Squad. UG onto the Harry Coco for the carry pain. Oh. Oh. Para siyempre sa Beleric. Oh. Ay, nako! Ah, Ay, malanti yata mga ah. kaibigan! Ay. Ginilayan ni Bats. Norma! Ay, 1-1! Oh. Nagkakagigilan. Haze onto the Joe Rebo para sa Leo Mord. At si Kuluwas naman gagamit ng Guinevere. Jeff Cutie for Ever Claude, Rio ang gagamit ng Esmeralda, Lusty ang Grok, and Jay ang Minsitar, Kuya Shinbu, oh. Luge ang Claude, 1v1, level 1, oh. sa isang true damage passive na yeah. meron ng isang carry. Totoo yan. Actually, may kasama naman si Claude doon, si Dexter, pero medyo payat. Medyo payat, 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 payat. Tama, tama, so, tama. So, talaga lugi talaga siya doon sa 2v1 scenario na yon. Anyway, guys, para mas lalong mag-init pa itong ating laban, the real, sa Realme boot po, may clappers na pinamimigay. There are clappers na given na the Realme boot, so make some noise with that. UG here, almost getting touched there by the energy wave. Butikan na, pero one man pa rin naman tayo ngayon. Correct, hashtag Real Gaming Pro, and syempre, binabati ko rin ng Gamely and ng Smart, pero kung yung Shinbu na ibigay na ngayon kay Mage Dad, UG, mm. at Another action Jackson type of oh. hero, the Harit, pare. Dalawa yan, di ba? Oh. Lunox o Harit. Or kahit ano, basta action Jackson, mm. hindi yung mga passive, passive setup dito. And this is a classic then, kasi makikita natin ulit ngayon, si Haze, si Haze on the show. And that is a tank emblem show, ha? Correct, tank emblem. Magpapakunan sila dito. Pero sure, Kiluash. you bet. Sabi ni Kiluwash dito, Ooh. there you go. Second kill para dito sa Arc Angel. This is a very, very interesting Kiluwash. Hindi si Rio ang, ang nasa Gwenevere, no? Oh. Oo, nako. Pero they're shutting down Jeff Cutie. Yeah. Ja sabi ni Jeff Cutie dito, nako, he is actually at the dangerous spot, Kuya Shinbu, kasi mas mahihirapan siya kumuha ng farm dito. They, actually, this is now a dead lane para kay Kuya mo, kay Kuya mo, Jeff Cutie forever. But 
Pero nakapatay siya ng isa. Y yung 1-1 ganina. Oh, yung 1-1 yung ganina. ganina oh. kayo, so pareha sila 1-1 nga nung Beleric dito. Nung Beleric, yeah. Actually, yan, yeah, na-push out nga si Claude doon. Expected naman yon Miniror na lang ng Archangel na makakuha din sila ng Turtle of their own. Oh, gra Nakita mo yung ano? Yung predictions? Oh, oh, oh. pero pumasok oh, oh. sila paring last ni Jan. Sabi dito ni Kuya Ribo, ako din. Ako Kala din, meron. Guys, napapansin nyo kung paano yung mga pro players maglaro. Predict. Na Nag-hook pa lang si Min Sitar, nakatutok na yung mga talon ni Esmeralda at ni Guinevere. Kung baga parang si Dr. Strange dito si ano, si Kuya Kiluwash. Nakita niya yung mga possibilities yun nga lang, hindi ito ma-advance pa sa advance, Kuya Shinbu. Kung baga, nauna pa sa first. Nauna pa sa first. Mahirap yun kapag nauna ka sa first. At early ka pa sa maaga. Totoo, totoo. Wala sa hulog yung ganun, di ba? Yun na nga ang nangyayari dyan, pare ko. One, two, one kill per minute ang nangyayari. Marksman set up ang dalawa dito. I like the Guinevere actually and the Esmeralda yeah. combination para dito sa Archangel. I'm, I'm very curious nga eh. Like Kiluwash, Guinevere is actually a proactive hero. Hindi oh. ito yung usual na pinapag-split push mo. Totoo. Nakaibang approach ngayon ito ng Archangel. As in, ganito ba ka-flexible talaga Archangel? As in, ito na ito ito na bottom lane side. Tingnan natin. Bulbasaur activated. Yung kanyang ultimation. At kita mo naman, wala pa rin magagawang sagot doon sa taas naman. Bite na bite ng Pokeball pero may hila na magaganap pero mukhang walang mapapata Ladies and gentlemen, actually, kiluwa siyang nawala. Jay. Pero si Jay, nako si Kuya Jay. Oh, Ay. pero baka UG yan, Mr. Oh, okay. Consistent. Shake it and bake it. Shake it and bake it. Bake it. no? Kumahadukin. Sumasonic boom, <laughs> Pesci, no? <laughs> Nako po, ma init, mainit, mainit. Ito yung game 3. Mainit talaga yung laban. Game 1, Archangel. Game 2, Brent Sports. Game, mo, game 3 sa atin. Ganito yung ano, mapagpigil hiningang game. Yabi. Mga babi. Mm -mm. Habang si Lasty sumusubok ditong depensahan ng kanilang torres sa bandang top lane, papasok dito si Jay. Okay. There's the Glock Glock, pero grabe naman. Yeah. Dash in, ja dash in, dash out. Hindi naman makakatuhog din dun. Siyempre yung mister natin with the Spear of Glory. Turtle is now up into the map. Ladies and gentlemen, Coco being seen here into the mid lane side. Okay, okay. Tignan natin dito. Actually, yeah. uh, the carry is a good counter then sa Grok, Kuya Shinbu. 7 oh. to 12% to 12 by, no damage on the passive. By the way nga pa, wala, sa information ng mga viewers namin, for yes. the most part, yung shoutcast namin dito, ang karamihan talaga mababanggit lang namin ay kung ano yung obvious Totoo. na nakikita ng player. At very best, we won't be giving out any information, any clue, any hints kung ano nagagarap at tinatago ng mga players natin dito kasi medyo semi-rinig pa eh. Tama, 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 tama ka dyan. Pero mukhang okay na natin sa Bihen dahil ang unang Totoo. bagong ay mapupunta sa Archangel. So you want that exchange na, na may pick oh. sa bandang taas pero sa bandang gitna, oh. sino ang nawala? Si Kapitan. Sa Kapitan, tatlo na yung deaths ni Payne doon. At ito nga ba yung sinasabi ni Doggy na baka oh. may tiltiration oh. na nagigaling kay Payne. Hayes, shaking and baking dead. At mukhang buhay pa si Hayes. Hindi, natuluyan ni Esmeralda dito. Sakto sa Aladdin. And now sumunod na lang din yung ating Leo Mord. Oh. Three members of Bren Esports getting clapped there by Archangel. The Arabian Jutsu mula sa Archangel dito. Esmeralda. In combination with Jay, the Min Sitar, Kuya Shinbu. Sa loob pa kayo ng King's Landing lalaban. At hindi ako makapaniwala, kayang-kaya pala talaga galawin ni Kiluwas ang Guinevere. Ang Guinevere. Oo. Boy, siya ang nag-initiate. Yeah, it makes your team a very, very flexible. Gets? Akala ako, puro lang split push, puro lang damos, puro lang hayabusa. Si parang kiluwa, may Guinevere pala din. Hindi pala pwede yun. Yeah, fighter din naman si Guinevere. Pero I was thinking for the most part that it is of Rio, na Guinevere player nila. She is considered a fighter mage. Parang Shinbo, hybrid ang galawan niya dito. And of course, with that passive, susundan at susundan ka talaga ng kanyang psycho ball. Sina psycho ka rin yan. And the more na meron kayong knock up, mas mainit kayo. And ang mahirap kasi sa Guinevere, if you are running a marksman lineup, kung aasa kayo sa normal hits, oh. kapag special migration niya, automatic yung una mong i-hit oh. yung oh. illusion. Yan, si Ribo, nagkakabal ng bakay Ayan, dito. Oh. Oh. Mga kaibigan. Okay, Kilu psycho ball. Sikiluwas si yan, sikiluwas si yan. Tinusok, tinusok. tinusok. Sisibahin, lamon pa! Ay, biometric win! Yabi, wala na siyang special migration na pwede magawa. Oy, oh! Meron! Hindi, anong special, special migration, Kuya Shin? Ah! May magic tap, pero andun pa rin si Ribo. Basta babae ka, tutuukin ka. Stick them with the pointy end, sabi dito ni paring Ribo. Yabi. Hindi pwede yan. Hindi pwede yan. Hindi pwede yan. Wala ka tusok, tusok gaming, ladies and gentlemen. Ito, hari ng tusok. Ang hari ng tusok. Tusok, mga kaibigan. But meanwhile, Claude dito, Jeff Cutie forever. Demon Hunter Sword.
Call Dead Stop, pwede na pumalag. Falling Star Moon, nandito okay, na Okay, Falling Star Moon, still the shield on that one. Nakap on to Coco, at getting shot down dito. Ni Jeff QT forever, a tower dive, baby! Oh my G, eto na Blazing Duet. Eto ang ayaw mo, paring Shin. Napakaaga nito ah, namatay si, si Jeff QT forever kanina. Pero around 6 minute, uh, the 6 minute Mark, uh -oh. meron siya kagad dalawang core item. Yun ay. And you don't want that kasi ang Coco, ang, uh, ang isang Claude, aasa yan mamaya. Pala sa Art of TV Retail, wala na lang. lang. Palagi na lang. Napapansin ko yung mga Claude, they usually wait out to really get into that late game to be that unstoppable force yes. na, to be crowned with. Pagpasok ng late game. Pero si Jeff, hindi. Ano late game, late game? Late game, late game. Sasama, alam mo, lumipat ako sa team na to. Sasamahan at sasamahan ko to. Hindi lang sa dulo, sa simula pa lang. Simula pa lang. And sabi ni Jeff Cutie forever dito, I'm taking my talent. I'm taking my I'm talents. Taking my talents. Tumunyos. Tumunyos. <laughs> Ako ang bagong Kevin Durant. I'ma join a new team. Yun ang magiging storyline dito, mga kaibigan. Pero four knives. Nako, eto na naman kung sino ata yung nasa blue side, yun ata ang nalulugi. And ewan ko, on this kind of play, there is a heavy demand to turn things around. Pwede. To get a multi-target knockup, to get a multi-target crowd control. Yes. And same situation ni Jay kanina, si Hayes lang ang available nun. You would have wished na merong Minotaur si Pain dito. But of course, Pain's job is to mitigate, soak up the damage, you using the ultimate the Balearic. Totoo, yung lineup din kasi dito ng Bren Esports, medyo biten sa Royal Rumble fight eh. Sa oh. sabayang pagbigkas, sabayang suntukan. Meanwhile, like Angel, ang dami nilang setup para maibigay kay Jeff Cutie Forever yung Art of TV rebuff na pag umabot ng 10 stacks para kang may libreng sprint. Yep. Kahit mag-sprint ka, tapos 10 stacks yun, habol, habol na habol ka, ka ni Jeff Cutie. Wala lang kailangan na BMI. <laughs> wala lang BMI. Walang BMI. Yung blazing to it, tapos 10 stacks, <laughs> kahit mag-sprint ka, wala. Sasaluin mo yung lahat, Kishin. Yapi, sir. Ibigat na Wintoker yata dito para kay uh, Rebo. Hindi mm -hmm. tayo namamali. Wintoker or maybe the Deadly Blade. Pero, well, let's just wait out to how will that roll. Para dito kasi, again, ang kailangan ng Archangel ay hindi lang yung item. Ang kailangan ng Bread Esports ay hindi lang items nila, yung setup talaga. Yes. And this is a nice opportunity. The Lord being taken in by Archangel. Pumuesto siya Ace na seed pa si Kiluash. Black Magic Kick, sabi dito. Kiluash, pero may special rotation. Maka-cancel out, ladies and gentlemen. Tore, ay naku, Lord. Lord na gusto ni Jeff, pero hindi pala. Si Jay ang unang mawawala. Ah. Pero hindi si Maring Yuji sa malang gilid. Naglabas ng Z4 sa kanyang spada. Jeff QT forever. This is your time, maybe. No, hindi. Sinagot pa rin siya ni Coco dito. Palitan mismo. Tatlo. Para sa tatlo. Grabe, sabayang pagbigkas. Abay, nako. Ay. Si Coco. Holy cams. Ay, nako. Cardo. Ah. Cardo. Ba't kasi hindi pa matapos-tapos yung palabas mo? Coco Dalisay, mga Coco. kaibigan! Nakumuli ka? Ang pinansagang Coco Martis! Oo, oh, men. Ay, Diyos ko, kitang-kita! Huli comes! Huli sa damo, men. Huli sa damo! At ngayon, Archangel, gusto na, nita tong, gusto na nila yung Lord, parang Shinbu. Grabe talaga si Kiluas dito, real MP3. As MP3, MP3. Siya yung pinasimula ng teamfight na yan. Oh. Hayes, trying to make that miracle play. No, he won't. And now, pasok doon si Kiluas ngayon. Tapos tingnan natin kung paano sasagot dito yung Brady Sports. Walang ano dyan, objective. Iniwan ang kapitan. Ay. Isama mo pa yung Liamar dyan. Grabe, pero matitira si parang Ryu dito. Siya ang magiging sacrificial hero para sa Archangel. There is the King's Calling. Oh. Mahila doon sa'yo magagana, pero wala. Lastly again. Nagpa-box out, naglalagay ng slow dito mm -hmm. si paring, uh, paring Coco. Pero tignan nyo yung minimap, mga chong. Oo nga, mga tricks. Jeff Cutie forever sa taas. Ang nasa gitna, yung Panginoon. At dun sa baba, yung Min Sitar. Archangel, ito yung ayaw na ayaw. You don't Ang mga want... kalaban nila sa Archangel. You don't want this. Laging na may pressure. La... Hindi lang yung Archangel, pati ang Onage. Oh. Lagi silang nagpa-pressure. Oh my G, sinabi natin, Bren Esports ang nagsimula ng pressure cooker gaming. Pero ngayon, pressure na naman sila on the blue side. I like this grok block technique sa bandang tore kasi wala kang choice eh. Kailangan mo talagang lumayo kasi pag lumapit ka ng onte easy set up yon sa spear yeah. ni Jay para hilain ka, Kuya Shin. Kasi dalawang choke points na lang yun. Dalawang eh. choke points na lang, oh. If ever you want to do deal damage. Pero of course, may means turn naman for that AOE wave clear. Yes. Yeah? And yung range kasi ng spear ni Jay, oh. naabot din sa axis ng tore. Uh, Kapag nasa gitna ka ng tore, pwede kang abutan. Aba, akala mo pala yung axis. Axis yan, boy, mat yan, uh, isusulat. Tinuro sa grade 4. Tinu no? Nabot, eh, ano? Second year high school naman. Year high school. Oh, <laughs> naman. Geometry. <laughs> Geometry. <laughs> Ewan ko ba, Geometry nga ba yun? <laughs> <laughs> Pero yun yun, boy. 12 minutes in, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my, hindi ko pa rin masabi, boy, Shindu. How do you deal with this? Winter Trunchon para kay Ryo. Oh my God. Yung lineup din kasi oh. ng Archangel pare. Jump Brothers eh. Oh, 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 oh. Jumping Spider. Oh my Tatalon God. Tatalon si Guinevere. Sobrang wild card nito. Ta Mga kaibigan, <laughs> oh again ha, remember, remember. 
kung sino manalo dito. Very, very close sa championship match point po sila. Dahil nga, uh -oh. momentum-based uh -oh. na ang isang best, best of three. Five. Ay, oo, oh, tama, uh -oh. Kuya Shin. Ngayon pa lang magkakaroon. Demon Hunter. Demon Hunter, Hunter sorry. Ano yung first score? Ano yung, ano yung first score items? Pro probably the... Uh, the Golden Stop. The Endless Battle. Endless Battle. Endless endless battle. battle. For the Demon Hunter sword, he, he wants to get the Shred. Yes. He wants to get the Shred na lang. Usually, go for the Thunder Belt after, oh, okay. after the Golden uh, the golden Stop. Pero yun na nga. Oh. Kera naman dito sa may panaka para kay Hayes. Pero mukhang wala pa rin tayo makikita ang makakakuha ng Deadpool as a Red Esports. The Holy Christ oh, na binibig pabis mo na kinubas dito. At napamali, napalo. Oh. Dito ngayon, si Paring Joe Hayes pa rin. No? After the Immortality, he's gonna be saying goodbye. Last thing, oh, Eric Klapp na double kill already. Para naman syempre kay Rebo. Coco then is defending their own turret against the Minion Wave. Nakay ko, nakay ko ko talisay na ata ang bola ngayon para oh. sa side ng Bren Esports. Kuya Shinbu, nice usage of the first skill, the spinning light wheel to slow down the enemies na pumapasok sa loob ng base. 80% uh -oh. slow yeah. yung spinning light wheel na yun, Kuya Shinbu. Yeah, you would have think, you would have think na push na sana yun ng Archangel pero tinaasan ng Bren Esports ang kanilang depensa at hindi ito maliparan ng Archangel sa kanilang opensa. They need one good blazing duet na magmumula kay Jeff Beauty Forever dito. Mukhang mas gusto niya yung burst type na laban. Kasi again, napag-usapan natin, jumping spiders ang Archangel. Uh, you have the spe special migration. Uh, okay. The falling star moon. It na-shoot doon sa King's Calling. Tapos dun ka pag-blazing duet sa loob. Oh, mga kaibigan, nanunood ang buong Pilipinas. Again, we are just down to the last two teams here. Eto na. Dito sa ating MPL Season 3. Chin! Na 14 minutes na tayo. Oh, oh. Isa lang ang ibig sabihin niyan. We are at the late game, game now. Ganun na nangyari oh, oh. dito, Kuya Shin. Mala Doctor Strange. Oh, nasa dulo na talaga tayo. Dulo ng walang hanggan. Ito na yung panahon na binigay mo yung time stone, no? Binigay na, binigay na yung time stone. Itamos. Ganun mm. na ang mangyayari dito. Corrosion Sight. Parang Shinbu, sama mo pa ng immortality. <laughs> ang yaman ni Jeff Beauty. Pinakamayaman, ladies and gentlemen, oh. kung nakita niyo yun. Pwede so, siya bumili ng Mustang. Pwede siya bumili ng Mustang. Pwede niya tayo ilibre lahat ng Gabi. milk tea. Oh. 12,900. Pwede siya bumili ng Realme. Oo, oh, ma. <laughs> pasok na pasok. Oh, ma. Realme, Realme, Realme 3 Pro. Oo oh, naman, oo oh, naman. Gano'n tayo dito, mga kaibigan, goes for Hayes. That is actually a big misstep there from the show. At doon, nila ikakash in yung pick ng Mincitar. Oh my G, all Ganda the shields. Oh, oh. All the shields kay paring Rio dito. Oh, di ba, maputi na ang buhok. <laughs> Pare, more than 5K ang buhay niya. Yabi. So, kung puti na yung buhok niya, 10K yung buhay niya, ganyan. <laughs> And hindi yan, yung buhay kasi ng Esmeralda, hindi siya countered as max HP. Uh -oh. So yung mga true damage percent na meron yung carry, wala lang din sa shield. Pasok. Pa oh, uh, ganun pa rin. Oh, ganun pa rin. Pa rin. Oh. Oh. oh my G, ladies and gentlemen. Lilipad na nga ba ang Archangel dito, parang Shinbu? Yun na nga ang malaking katanungan. Gaano kapal at kataas ang depensa pwedeng magawa ng Red Esports ngayon? The Lord is already pushing in favor of Archangel. Obviously, that is gonna be going in to the mid lane side. Of course, Red Esports would just go into their own base. It's very, very risky, especially with the pickups of the Spear of Glory. Magic Dump then ng Greedy Bear dito. Mm -hmm. And they go out, they can easily get a knock-up mula sa mga membro ng Archangel. Here we go. Pero galit na, galit na ang Lord. Sumugod na, eto na naman. Eto naman, mga mga kaibigan ng King's Calling, mm. pumasok pa ang Kuala Star Moon. Nakakaagad sila mga kaibigan ng Kibili dito. Ultimate, siyempre rin ang ating Valeric. Pero makikita naman naman yung bawas at buhay dito oh. ni Jay na namaalam. Yung Lord ngayon ang nasa pagpunta ng harapan. At si Jay naman ay mawawalan dito ng ating immortality. Oh. Pero, Kilowas would make an answer dito. At dun sa may bandang baba ay mawawala na rin ang ating inhibitor chariot. Mission accomplished yeah. para sa Archangel. Chill lang. Gawin nating makulay ang mundo. <laughs> Archangel, Archangel, Archangel. Ating mundo ay gawing makulay. Oh! Pero nako, nawala na ng buhay. Yeah. Si paring Jeff Beauty Forever. Jeff Beauty Forever getting delivered into the base. That is a misplay punish here by the Bren Esports squad. Ma'am, ba... Ah, sigaw lang Archangel. Aliyup mula kay Hayes. Sabi ng Bren, Ops, no easy basket. Oh, Even oh. though makuha nila dito ang mga oh. tore. My line of defense pa sila. They have all the damage in the world, paring Shinbu. What's interesting dito, hindi ko makita ang Berserker's Fury to give the crits na magbumula dito kay paring Yuji. Yeah. Sinasabi ng Bren Esports dito, rising star kayo, pero tandaan nyo, kami pa rin ang buwan dito, kami pa rin ang Bren mismo. Kami ang nagpauso ng lang malakas. Oo, kami lang ang malakas, oh, mga kaibigan. My... Yes. At ngayon, dito sa Season 3, kung saan ang dami ng malakas, Tingnan natin ang tunghayan kung how will all of this one conclude. Here goes for Jay oh. and Jay getting destroyed here. Items cashing in by the carry. Thunderbelt available. Killing spree para kay Coco oh, oh. Dalisay dito. Two oh, oh. minutes in ang ating papasok ah, ano na Lord. 
pa end of season na. Pa end of, pa end of, season. Pa end of season na yung, yung serye yung ni Coco. Yung serye ni Coco Dalisay, mga Oo. kaibigan. Having the Thunder Belt for the extra, extra Oo. HP. Pwede na lumaya yung Bendetta. Bendetta, Bendetta man, dito, uh, mga babi. Okay na. Oh my G, na kay Coco yeah, ang bola. Yeah. At, at that rate, yes, guys, ang lamang na lang po dito ng Archangel ay yung pressure sa gitna at dun sa may bandang baba. Pero guys, do not ever think na kapag nagkaroon ng class dito, surety ang panalo ka agad ng Archangel. Magkaiba. Without so, I think napaka-risky na ng carry dito. Ating pong pagmasdan sa tingin ko, parang Shinbo ha, kapag nag-clash ka, gaya nga lang sabi uh. mo, yung dalawang carries, yung dalawang marksman, sa laban na to, 6-2-3, si Baring Coco, 4-4-8, si Jeff Cutie Forever, medyo consistent, yes. magandang KDA, yes. pero sa galaw nila, madidetermine uh. ang laban dito dahil late game na tayo. And remember, Coco has a Beleric. Beleric is still in the late game, it's still Beleric, it still mitigates the damage. The Beleric yeah. Clinic, yeah. which is sinabi natin kanina, yung passive ni Beleric oh. dito, yung Flower of Nature, Isang semi-counter yeah. mm. sa isang marksman kagaya ni Jeff Cutie Forever. And look at that. Of course, the obvious counter for Coco, hindi naman talaga basta susugutin at susugurin ni Jeff Cutie Forever yan. Again, ang gagawin or ang habol kay Coco dito ay ang mga tulad ni Rio, ang mga tulad ni Kilua. But Ito, oh. Rose Gold Meteor is now available as well for Coco. Oh you cannot God. easily burst him. May Thunderbelt pang kasama. May Thunderbelt okay. pang kasama. So, kada phantom step mo, may prok ng kuryente. Oh, one, two, three, phantom step. Sasabayan, oo, oh, sasabayan ni Coco dito <laughs> yung kulog ng kitla, question. <laughs> oh, oh my God. God. Ala, um, mararamdaman mo, ang katahimikan ngayon ito sa Nepa Pavilion. Mainit, mainit. Aim high, paasay, binabati ko ang ating mayor. <laughs> mayor Calixto. Repin from ka na. Repin from Pasay to, oh. boy. Oh, no. <laughs> Lahat ng mga taga-Pasay dyan. Aim high, pero balik tayo sa ating ball game ko yung Shinbu, 19 minutes. Napakatagal ng ating laro uh, ngayon. Stall game ang nangyayari, yes. mga kaibigan. And of course, guys, we cannot disclose anything here. We want that our players correct the most of their own position para sa ito pero ayun nakita ni Lasty syempre si Pain at si Coco dito actually nagkakabentahan na dito ng items ko yung Shinbu just to get the immortality Yabi. item eh Yabi. para lang ma-extend yung team fight dito Ak actually yeah. inaantay ko nga na may mag-malefic roar na nga eh oh yeah pag pwede pag-pwede na yung pag-pwersahan na talaga ng push eh. pero piling ko buka malabo kasi everyone is just preparing with this kind of itemization for the team fight the team fight I think will happen oh. in front of the Lord ito na oh my glab Brace yourselves. Na, brace yourselves. Kapit sa mga na. upuan. Cameraman, alo boy, let's go. It's time. <laughs> Here we go. Sipa. Black magic kick. Naku po. Nahog sa may gera dito. Napatumba yung win si Tarver. May mortality yan. Sa ibang bahagi. Inabot si Jeff Forever dito na control. Ang kanya placing to win. Oh my G. Doon sa bandan likod. Rio. Rio, Rio and Lasty. Ay, naku po. Nandito si Page na Juji. Sa may likod. Lasty. Avengers. Assemble. Like Angel. Magmamamba out na. Piyapi at walang pwede. Ay, hindi. Hindi, tinitingnan. The Crash Gear! The Crash Gear! Yung mga Crash Gear! Yun na nga eh, yun na nga eh. Si oh. Ryo, ay nako, Ryo! Ay nako! Kulik kita ko! Street Fighter! Oh my so, God! Ryo, get up! Ryo, trying to redeem himself again. Nakita ko na to sa ay. laban sa exec. Ryo, ginagawa mo! Winter Traction ng kamatayan. One is to one. Bren Esports. Sila lumamang doon sa laban, paring Shinbu. Nakita ko na to, Trick. Sa replay, Trick. Na replay to. The replay. I saw it from the future. You come from the future, bro. Pini pinirata pa nga to sa YouTube. Yun na nga nangyari, Bobby. Ilang beses na. Isang one hit. Isang one, one hit. hit. Remember that video, Trick. It was Rio trying to finish the game. Parang ganun Kaso, din. Oh Kaso ang nangyari, Kuya Shinbu, hindi isang one hit yung base. Po, 14 million hits pa! <laughs> Siguro nga mga tanim na one hit yun. 10 bits! Isang 14 million hits! 10 bits, mga bes! Oh my G, what a finals, Kuya Shinbu! Again, the one who's trying to come back here ay ang Bren Esports. Dinala ng Bren Esports ang espiritu ng Signal Ultra dito. You know that they're the one who denied Signal Ultra. Mas lahat pa po sa MSC. At kita nyo mga Bobby D, basag ngayon yung mid lane turret. Unang, Anong nangyayari? Ang ganitong trend, this is in favor of Bren. Unang turret, Kuya Shinbu. Let's see, Kuya Rio, kung may pesto na naman dito. But meanwhile, meanwhile, ang tunay na hunter. Oo, oh, oh, pero syempre, nakahanda lang din tayo. Kalma, kalma, oh, kalma. Syempre, kung, kung, tignan natin. Again, di tayo talaga pwede mag -re 
bin ng mga <laughs> anong mga plano correct, ng mga plano ng, ng mga black magic kumbaga samahan niyo lang kami ladies and gentlemen oh, oh. sa pag-acting na kunyari walang naglo-lord oh. <laughs> walang nagte-tape ng objectives dahil mas gusto namin na mas tama at mas Guys, maibigay ng mga players again ang maximum potential nila what you are witnessing in front of you dito sa Lepa Billion ay ang daan okay Ang tunay the, last, na the last fight in crowning na, the oh, strongest, the strongest mobile legends team sa buong Pilipinas. Kuya Shinbo, I like the wind of nature pick para kay Coco dito. Oh. It can negate some of the damage of na course. meron sa Blazing Duet. Duet of course. Sakto yun. Yung cooldown nung uh, proc nung ano nun, medyo mawawala yung Blazing Duet um, dito kapag na-timingan. 22-minute game, ladies oh, and gentlemen. My and ang hirap, stunning si Dr. Strange lang ang nakakaalam. Ng future. How, how will this end? Ng future. Ang problema dito, Kuya Shinbo, bawal natin sabihin kung ano ang future kasi hindi mangyayari. Nagkakabintahan na ng boots. Wala ng boots-boots, sabi ni Coco. Even though, mahilig siya sa mga sapatos. Oh. Ganon. He's willing to give up his shoes oh. para lang maging kampion. Tama, tama ka dyan, Kuya Shinbo. Pero gusto kong pagmas dito si Jay, ah, kasi nagiging battle type na rin siya dito yeah. para having the BOD. Okay, tumunog na. Pinasimulan na ng Red Esports kayo ng Lord. That one we can easily mention. They're also scouting. Grabe ang respeto kay Lastic. Respect. Sobrang grabe ang respect the MC. Respect the As MC. Mag-isa lang talaga siya doon. Pero you can actually see they aborted it. Yeah, you... Napaka-risky daw. Yes, parang grok. Eh. Tingnan mo ha, 16 assists. <laughs> Bobby, oh, the diba? ultimate playmaker. <laughs> ang grok na Lastic dito. And actually, pwede-pwede niya malasit. Kasi pwedeng umabot ng 1K. Yung damage ng power of nature. Indeed, machine. indeed. Parang Manjin. Oh my J. Ino muna na tubig. Ino muna Manjin, na tubig. Sana ganyan ka mag-carry. Sana ganyan ka mag-clone. Mukha lang. Alam mo, nag-training na ako kay Kaya Doggy. May itiks nga tayo. Pero sana ganun ka rin mag-silay na. Anong parang ganun na. <laughs> Kuya Shinbo. Pero kidding aside, ladies and gentlemen, eto na ang laban. Alright. We got the ultimate getting forced out of Lusty here. Of course, you have to mem remember, this is the classic and signature Archangel playstyle. Oh, pressure my. across the map. The pressure Ma plus the sandwich. Mga technique. kaibigan, ito ang tunay na lipad Archangel. Napakataas ng scope nila oh, in yeah. approaching a game. They always make sure that the sidelines are always getting pushed. Correct. Not to mention the Lord always getting checked. Yun na nga eh, so, parang walang may gustong. mag-face check ng Lord dito yeah. eh. Kasi kung sino pwede mauna ng Lord, di mo oh! alam, oh, nako, eto yung Shoryuk at Violet Requiem. Yeah. Special Migration out, nilabas ang Phantom Team. Oh, Phantom Stop. Na patay ito, oh, patay ito. Si oh, okay, that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Tumatagot ang alaman niyo, pero tuloy tayo sa laban natin. Champion ni Forever Casting is, of course, he's placing to win. Ah! At kita mo, wasak pa rin doon si Lasty ngayon. At wala pa rin na papatumpa mula sa side ng Bren Esports. Oh my G, sabi ni Captain Payne dito, let's go Rebo. With a beautiful initiation. On to Kiluwa, yeah. sparring shin. Rio. Going for the miracle play. Oh. Despite all the doubts against him, he will still go for the dive. Ladies and gentlemen, Jeff QT forever wants to go for the pressure. The Lord has been slain. Ah. He's going for the push. Para sa Beleric dito. Oh, yes, the medium wave. The medium wave going for the push as well. Pinatungan ang Lord. And it's still not yet over. Hindi pwede yan. Bren lang malakas. It ain't over till it's over, Bobby! Oh my G! Sabi ni Jeff Cutie, Teka, hindi ako si CKTD! Sister team ko lang yun! Akala ko ako si CKTD! Oh my G, pare! What a game! What a game! Bren Esports! And I doubt this is still over! I doubt this is still over! Yes, my lord! But the timers are quite short! Ito na ang end game! Ito na ang end game! Ito na ang end game! Sports at match point here. Taking this game three on a two one.